11 years ago, almost right around this time, no one was nervous about disappointing black people. Color of Change is a 21st century racial justice organization that works to uh, push back against the policies and practices that hold black people back and champion the solutions that move all of us forward. So much of the work that happens in activist spaces or social justice, we sometimes mistake presence for power. But mistaking presence for power is how we get ourselves into trouble. The ability to translate presence, people paying attention, people talking about your issues, people aware, into the ability to force decision makers to be nervous about disappointing you. And as a result, to have to make decisions in your favor is at the heart of what we do. District attorneys who are the most powerful actors in the criminal justice space also determine whether or not police are held accountable. Our PAC has been focusing on district attorneys' races this election cycle, so we can start changing the way that we're dealing with the fact that right now, 85% of district attorneys run unopposed. They have no incentive to actually think about the communities that they're serving if they're gonna consistently get elected over and over again by doing the same thing. What are the best ways for Credo members to work as allies with Color of Change? In particular, our work around district attorneys and our work around bail is work we're going to be doing over the next several years. And we also need to engage in district attorneys, races in places where black people may not have a whole lot of political power, a political strength. And we need Credo members to stand with us. On behalf of um, our Credo team here and thousands, tens of thousands of yes. members who voted, here's a check for $57,639. Thank you. For a color of change. Thank you all very much. We talk a lot about um, allyship at Color of Change, but today I feel like I'm with people who have been in solidarity with us, which is a much deeper um, commitment to walking the walk, um, standing um, in moments of struggle and in moments of opportunity. This is why we come to work every day at Credo, and it's why everyone joins Credo in the first place. We care about the progressive activism. We care about the nonprofits that we fund. So we want you all, the members, to hear directly from our nonprofit partners because you make it possible.